Hi, I'm Kevin. And I'm Amanda. And we are serving up all that jam. All that jam, quick hit. Brian Haas on meeting Reed Mathis. When did you meet Reed? Because the next thing we have coming up is Reed with Electric Beethoven, and then you have the the Jacob Fred shows coming up. Did you meet Reed when you were like 16? or? Uh, I was 19, and he was 17. Okay, and, and that's when the band started? That's when the band started. Like, I really, I was doing all the bass. Hey, James, is there a plug-in close by? Yes, I have to leave. Okay. This is all the new stuff. It's all the new stuff? And you you will leave the, the key will be in the mailbox okay. and he's in the there. mailbox. And leave it there. James is giving me all his new music in a folder, which is incredible. Nice. Because the computer's about to die. Hopefully someone records it. So yeah, Reed and I've been playing together since I was Thank you, Jamie. Reed and I've been playing together since I was nineteen and he was seventeen. Okay. This is mine. This is all the James Singleton's new music right here. Wow. And I'm going to take it home and make sure that I am able to read the ink tomorrow. Right. Because James loves everything free and everything improvised, but he wants me to read the ink the, the first time through. <laughs> and if I don't read the ink, I'll be at the piano and everybody oh, no. will hear him yell, wow. read the ink, Hoss. <laughs> like, yes, Maestro. Yes, I will do better. I will read the ink. But Reed and I have been super close. Since I was 19 and he was 17, uh, we've written so much music together, toured the entire world together many times. And we we had a falling out that was totally normal and natural and made sense. When you, I mean, Reed and I did 300 shows a year for... You didn't stop for years and years. For 10 I mean, years. Like, yeah. like, like we did... 300 or more shows a year for about 10 years. And that's going to freak anybody out. You know, it's totally normal and totally natural. But we stopped playing together around 2008, 2009. And Jacob Fred kept going, you know, like in, you know, Jacob Fred's been together now for about 30 years. And Jacob Fred's had about 20 different members in 30 years. And so Jake and Fred kept doing our thing. We used to hire Skerrick all the time. We had a lap steel guitarist. We had a, a different drummer. But Reed and I started playing together again uh, in 2016. And so a lot of these shows, people are saying, reunion show, reunion. And it's like, well, that's a, I guess that's a good way to market it. But right. Reed and I took about an eight-year break. We didn't play from 2008 to 2016. And that eight year break was so good for both of us. I wouldn't trade it for the world because now we're playing at a way higher level than we ever would have been had we just stayed together and done the grind and continued being grumpy with each other. We got a nice little eight year break. We were asked to, in 2016, we were asked to do a three night run in San Francisco and we hired Simon Lott, who's a drummer from New Orleans, who's one of the greatest living drummers. I mean, he's insane. He'll be at Sauce Fest. And, and, yeah, Tuesday. And, and I have just kept going ever since 2016. And right now, you know, the drummer we use is Jason Smart, which we call him the, you know, that that's the OG trio. That's really the band that, that blew up was the band with myself, Reed and Jason Smart. And that's what we're doing right now. And it just sounds better than ever. If you are enjoying All That Jam, please like and subscribe to our social media channels at All That Jam Pod on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, or visit our website, allthatjampod.com. Make sure to sign up for our email list and tune in every week for new episodes. Also, look for full interviews on our YouTube channel. And remember, stay beautiful, but don't stay underground too long.